today we got some new gameplay of the Hurricane level from the Spyro Reignited Trilogy. Of course it ain't that much of new gameplay, I mean it is an extended version of the SDCC panel gameplay that we saw. Um, so, it's not too much of anything. Of course we did get a better look at the Electrols and stuff. That was gameplay that was posted by the official Spyro Dragon YouTube channel. Uh, with one of the game's developers or programmers uh, showing a non 100% walkthrough just for a thousand um, and he pretty much discusses the game and the level itself I didn't watch the whole thing or listen to it but I will let it play for you guys in, the, in, in its full entirety so hope you guys enjoyed watching um, once again I've been Blue Knight and this is the end of the Spyro Reunite Trilogy update. I'll have another video posted soon. Um, so, yep. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed watching. Uh, and you can also find me over on Twitter, or on Sonic Stadium, or on, over on my Blue Knight V2.0 blog, over on Patreon, where you can become a patron and contribute as little as a dollar per month to help my site and my channel grow, become the next level source of video game news. So, once again, guys, I've been Blue Knight, and I will see you next time. Goodbye. Hey everyone, it's Lou from Activision here, one of the producers on the Spyro Reignited trilogy. Today we will be showing you a playthrough of Hurricos, which is one of the realms from Spyro 2, Ripto's Rage. Now this is part of the homeworld Summer Forest. Hurricos is constantly being hit by giant thunderstorms, which works out well for the Electrols who inhabit it. Now these guys use the electricity to power the small machine soldiers that they build. Unfortunately, the Electrols are constantly being harassed by large, muscular brutes called the Gear Grinders. These Gear Grinders love sabotaging the machines in Hurricos to cause trouble for the Electrols and Spyro. So one of the initial goals in Hurricos is to walk around collecting these diodes to be able to turn off the force fields that the Electrols are trapped behind. Hurricos specifically is a great example of how the team at Toys for Bob has remained faithful to the original game's look and feel while enhancing the designs with additional details. Now we've got awesome lighting and visual effects and all these things that we're able to achieve on current gen consoles that just make this look amazing. The key gameplay devices in the level, the diodes and the force fields, all emit dynamic lighting, which adds a sense of realism and immersion, making the players feel the urgency of needing to turn off these force fields. Some of the characters in the Reignited trilogy required a bit more inspiration and reinterpretation because of what was originally there, but the characters in Hurricos, the Electrols, Gear Grinders, and their robots are all really faithful to their original designs. So here you can see how Toys for Bob enhanced and reimagined some of the interactions between enemies. You've got the Gear Grinders actually working on the robots. There's also some really fun additional details, like the gear logo on the back of the Gear Grinders jacket. So as we're exploring through these grassy plains, just be sure in the midst of all this awesome action that you're listening into the Reignited Trilogy's remastered soundtrack of Stuart Copeland's classic score. Although some fans may be familiar with Hurricos from the original games, the additional level of detail that Toys for Bob has added really adds to a sense of discovery and this feeling of being in a new world for the Reignited Trilogy. One of the things that the team's done is really made the metallic coating of fire immune items like the robots and the vases and treasure chests really shine. So it's really easy to see when you need to use fire and when you need to charge. So the Electrols are each a slightly different hue to give them all a unique appearance. And we've also added some fun VFX to their glasses. You'll actually notice that behind their glasses, their eyes look like squinty little mole eyes. This talisman from the gear grinders. Please take it as a reward. All right, and so here you'll see that we've got our talisman for the level bringing this level to an end. So thank you everyone for taking a look at our playthrough of Hurricos, and we can't wait for you to get your hands on it and discover all of the awesomeness 
that is the Spyro Reignited trilogy. Thanks, everyone.